when you do something new and brave, uh, you, you have lots of difficulties to overcome. And that's where Renishaw have been um, fantastic. They've worked with the, the Hope and Lotus engineers to do that refinement at breakneck speed. In the past, it would take months to go from the drawing board to a piece that you could try on a test rig or in the velodrome. Now it can be done in, in weeks. When you work for British Cycling, you're working with absolute world-class performers. Everything's got to be world-class. So what we want from this, this bike is world-class performances. You want to lose by fractions of a second, so every single little bit counts. And if a bike can even give you slight as little gain, then that could be enough to have the upper hand on, the, uh, on an opponent, yeah. The, the, the forks, instead of minimising the drag of the bike by making as sort of low drag a bike as possible, um, we've tried to impact the drag of the rider um, by forcing the airflow over the forks um, and disrupting it before it hits the legs. Like your bike just becomes an extension of the body and you get used to how everything feels and the way it sounds and but yeah, it's, it's unusual that you get on a completely different bike and straight away it feels better. The world is embracing this, this rapid um, uh, development cycle and additive manufacturing is probably the biggest single step.